Okay, now we're going to learn how to make a uh, fire effect on text in Photoshop. So I'm going to start a new document. That's great. I'm going to make it black. Let's get some text in there, shall we, in white. Uh, it's going to make it a little bit bigger. So 72. Yeah, so fire. Uh, it's going to drag this out a little bit bigger as well so you guys can see. It's about there. Looks good. Apply that. Okay, so first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to go to transform and we're going to rotate that counter or clockwise. We're going to go to filter, go to stylize wind. It's going to ask if you can uh, rasterize it. Actually, before we do that, let's just uh, let's copy that layer. So we have an original version and we'll turn that off. All right, so we, on our fire copy, we're going to go to stylize, wind. Yes, we want to rasterize, that's fine. And we're going to go from the left and make sure it's on wind. And you can see we've got some little uh, spikes coming out. So we're going to go wind again and one more time. So we've got quite a dramatic effect going on. Now we want to transform that back counterclockwise. So it's sticking straight up. All right. Now we want to play with the colors a bit. Well, before we do that, let's uh, blur it a little bit. Let's go to Gaussian Blur. Yeah, let's get down about yeah about 2.8. You can play with it. So, you know, get it to however you want. Now we want the colors. We go to Adjustments. We go to Hue Saturation. Go to Colorize. We will drop the lightness a bit. You know, try and get an orangey. That's a nice uh, yellowy orange right there. Let's um, duplicate that layer. And we want to hold down uh, Shift or Command on Mac. We're going to merge those two layers together. Now we're going to go to Liquify. Make sure it's uh, selected, brush size, I've got it around 15. We're going to create some movement in the flames coming off now. Actually, I might make it a little bit bigger. Let's make it about a 20, 25 maybe. Might be good. All right. Now just, you know, wiggle around like flames would come off your text. You know, just click on it and wiggle it up. Now I'm going to shrink it a little bit and just uh, you know, do a couple of licks coming off here and there. I'm just doing this really quickly for you guys, so take your time with it as you should always. Get it looking perfect. All right. That might be enough for now. Click OK. And there you go, we've got some uh, nice uh, movement going. Now I'm going to duplicate that layer. I'm going to go to layer styles. I'm going to pick you know, a linear light. I'm going to duplicate that one again. Get a little bit, a couple more. You know, get it looking real kind of fiery. Now, get your original fire. Let's bring that back up top. And let's transform that back counterclockwise. Bring that into the middle of your fire. So. And let's add a outer glow to it. And there we go. That's how we create a uh, fire effect on your text in Photoshop.